Today we are doing something that I don't think we've ever done on the channel ever before and this time we're going to be going on a two day hike to a village, an abandoned village that is said to have hundreds of people burned alive. If you guys have never heard about this place, don't worry, I'm going to go into the history a little bit later but all you need to know right now is somewhere down this trail is a village that was burned down by some kind of curse. Recently, a couple of paranormal investigators like myself ventured down this road to find the village and have yet to be seen again. So our job is to go in there, find those investigators, and hopefully bring them back home safe and alive. I don't really know what to expect out of this video, guys, but as you can tell behind me, everything seems to be completely overgrown. Right now, we're on a pretty busy street, so it's a little noisy. But once we're deeper into the woods, it's gonna get way more quiet because we have two days of hiking on this overgrown road right here. So if you guys are ready to see us explore the undead village somewhere in the depths of this abandoned location, make sure to go down below, subscribe to the channel because this is the type of stuff I do all the time. And I should mention this is one of many episodes of my series on the channel that I call Chapter 2. If you guys haven't seen the first part of Chapter 2, it was absolutely insane. So go up here, check the top right, it'll be right there for you. And if you don't want to miss any of the future parts in the Chapter 2 series, again, go down below, subscribe, you're not going to want to miss it. So with all this being said guys, I think it's time for us to take our hike. Let's go down this road, let's see exactly what the Undead Village has in store for us tonight. In the late 1900s, there was a town that was built in the middle of the woods by the name of Hollowville, a place specifically built for the mentally ill. It was a sanctuary for those that society claimed as unfit. Unknown to many, Hollowville wasn't just a regular town, it was a ticking time bomb of terror waiting to be unraveled. One fateful night, a bizarre event occurred that would change the history of this town forever. A strange figure appeared in the town that was known as the Cursed Seer, who was a psychic with a dark secret. He predicted a terrible fate for the town of Hollowville and left behind a cryptic curse that would lay heavy in the air. Time passed and the town's inhabitants lived in fear, haunted by the foreboding prophecy. The curse seemed to seep into the very soul of the town, driving the patients into a deeper abyss of insanity. The chilling cries and deranged laughter resonated in the dense woods, adding to the eerie aura of Hollowville. One stormy night, true to the cursed seer's prediction, tragedy struck. Lightning hit the main building, setting it ablaze, and the flames spread rapidly, consuming the entire town and its inhabitants. The cries of the doomed patients echoed throughout the night, their agony dancing with the flames. By dawn, Hallowville was reduced to ashes, with only a handful of survivors to tell the tale. The village now has a very unsettling presence, as if the spirits who burned in the fire still lingered, trapped in the ashes of the doomed sanctuary. Shadowy figures are found darting through hallways, whispering their tales of anguish. Cryptic symbols, possibly remnants of the Cursed Seer's Curse, were etched into the grounds and walls, adding to the eerie ambience of the village. The town was soon forgotten, with its tragic history fading into oblivion until today, where decades later, paranormal enthusiasts stumbled upon the legend of the undead village. Intrigued, they decided to explore the hollow village, unaware of the horrors that awaited them. To this day, these paranormal investigators have yet to be found. Hollowville may have been destroyed, but its tormented spirits live on. It is said that somewhere in the village there is a secret tunnel system where some of the remaining survivors come and go as they please, trapped in an endless cycle of their fury end, and forever reminding the world of the curse that brought them to their horrifying fate. And with all that being said, I present to you the Undead Village movie. Enjoy. Thank you. Okay, hopefully the whole trail isn't completely overgrown. Right? But uh... Thank God you're walking first though. Yeah, making the trail for you. Mm -hmm. There already seems to be something here, so... Look at this mess. Mm -hmm. 
I wonder how far this is gonna take. Maybe this is why it takes two days to get there. Not too bad, until you Just hit a... The, uh, the bushes here. <laughs> the, the, thorn one, bushes yeah, the thorn bushes. That are secretly everywhere. You brought a machete, right? Yeah, let me just grab it. Just kidding. This is all I have for you. This is your machete? Yeah. <laughs> Did that even do anything? The machete broke. Oh. Okay. This isn't too bad over here. You can kind of see like remnants of like stuff that used to be here, like a sewage thing. Another one all the way over there. I don't know if you can see it on the camera. I can not see it from the camera, but I can see it with my own eyes. I was trying to say, like, you never answered as to if you believe in any of this. Uh, like, you know. Do you think the Undead Village is there, or is this just like a hoax? Because it seems pretty crazy. I feel but. like I will 100% be able to answer that once I see it, once we get there. Okay. Other than that, I think I, I think I'll just say that I'm here for the vibes, you know, the overgrown vibes, the undead, the undead vibes, the undead vibes. you know, pretty good vibes. The, the hike, undead. you know, I love hikes. Yeah. The hike vibe, yeah. That's what I'm here for right now, and that's what I believe in. Okay. Well, the hike is definitely going to satisfy you, hopefully. Yeah. But uh, until the mosquitoes kick in, well, then so far, it'll be so a good. different story. You got the bug spray, right? Yeah. Yeah. For sure. <laughs> oh wow, look at this. I love that you have it then. <laughs> Open space. Barely. What was that? Five minutes? Yeah. We got a long day. A long day ahead. We might want to save some battery. So is this it? Looks like it. Straight south. Guys, I'm pretty sure this is the entrance to the forest where the undead village is supposed to be. And there seems to be like some kind of fence telling us not to go in, but you know us. What does that say? Do not enter dead inside. What? That's weird. Do not enter dead inside. Well, this is supposed to be where the undead village is. That's kind of creepy. Do not enter dead inside. Yeah, I would say do not enter is normal at this point. Yeah, yeah. For all at of your point, kind of it's... adventures, it's, it's normal, but the... The dead inside, now that's yeah. new. That's kind of creepy. And it looks super overgrown, guys. Like, I don't know yeah, there's gonna... like no clear path whatsoever. Okay, well, ladies first. Ladies first? Yeah. Fine, let me show you how it's done. You should probably stretch first. Mm -hmm. How many fences are we gonna jump this series? <laughs> I was going to say, this is like three in a row now. <laughs> okay. Stable. Okay. Uh, yeah. As stable as she can be. But I would say this is the easiest fence I've climbed. Ta-da! I've wow. made it. Now your turn. Let's go. Come on. It's literally so overgrown. Oh. Nice. Now, okay. So after you, there should be like some kind of trail because this was Ooh. a village at one point. Oh my and gosh. And roads did reside here, so. Okay. Let's well. just walk deep enough into the forest until we find like some kind of trail or something. Okay. Well, there's definitely no trail, but there are definitely mosquitoes. Oh yeah. Michelle really knows how to pick the adventures we go on. Well, people aren't really supposed to be here. No, I'm saying in general, Michelle. Your adventures always got mosquitoes in them. Holy crap. So right? this is gonna be real thick if like, we go through here. We should have worn boots. I'm okay. gonna put the camera away just so we could like actually walk through this and hopefully 
down somewhere in there, we'll be able to find some kind of trail that will lead us to the undead village. Okay. Looks like there's an opening over here. You okay? Yeah. Just gotta climb over this. Oh. Careful. Oh God. Yeah, it looks like we're getting somewhere. Well, I guess that's good news. Whew. That was so much, so much grass. Yeah, check for, check ticks. for ticks. Yep. I'm not wearing the best socks for this. <laughs> no. Okay. All right, we're bug free. Yeah. You're good? Yeah, I'm good. Okay, let's keep going. So the compass kept telling us to go this way. We're just following the sun, keeping it behind us before it sets. But, uh, alrighty. We can actually walk now, so mm -hmm. let's look around. Whew. For any kind of trail. I mean, at least we got good weather. Yeah, if it was raining right now. <laughs> it would be a maybe, little. Yeah, we'd be picking little, a different day. A little bit uncomfortable. That was the case. Found something here. Ooh, look at this. There's a whole trail. Oh yeah. Well, I mean, it looks like there's kind of a there's bunch of too. trails. Yeah. Well, since the sun's back there, we want to keep this way. Hopefully, this trail might take us straight to the village. I don't know. There's not much information on this place, guys. So at this point, we're kind of just guessing. Yeah, look at this. This looks pretty official, right? Yeah. Looks pretty official as an official trail gets, in my opinion. Alrighty. Let's keep going. I love how it's sand. There's a footprint right here. A couple footprints going this way. Looks That's like we're not the only one. Yeah, there's a bunch of them here. Or maybe just a couple. It's hard to tell. Who would be walking around out here? Especially on this path. We just had to go through God knows what to get here. Yeah. I mean, it could be those investigators. They might have found the same trail as us. So guys, right now, it's around 7 o'clock. For about an hour before the sun's officially down. So now that we're on the trail, we should be able to cover way more ground than we did pretty much all day. <laughs> Not on the trail. <laughs> yeah. And... Seems like we're making pretty good time. What else did I want to say? Um, what is that? What the hell is that? Who is that? Yo. He's going into the woods. What the hell? What's that? I know. Should we like go help them? Did you see what they were wearing? Yeah. What are they doing all the way out here in the middle of the woods? Should we go see if they're okay? What is that? You think that was someone from the village? They were literally wearing like the doctor gown or whatever it's called. Well, if they are from the village, do we maybe shouldn't? Michelle. We're fine. As long as we're on the trail. see him anymore. Should be easy to spot. He was wearing all white. I know. He was like white and blue or something. Should we call out for him? I don't think that's a good idea. He didn't seem like all there in the head, you know. 
Exactly. Exactly my point. Are we safe out here? How many are there? Just like roaming around out here. I don't know. That's if it's one of the people from the village. I mean, it looked like it. I mean, even if I did want to help. They're gone. I have no idea where he just went. <sighs> okay, well, we still need to find somewhere to set up a tent, so... Let's just keep moving. I'm pretty sure that was just like... I don't know, someone who like frequently walks the trail. It's just normal things here, yeah. near the undead village. <laughs> well, it's still a days away, so I don't get like, why would someone from the village be out for so far? Yeah. Weird. Okay, well, I mean, if we see him again, then we can definitely ask him if he's okay. Yeah. Hopefully he just finds his way home. I don't know if I want to see him again. Yeah, that wasn't me saying I want to see him again. <laughs> I'm just saying if we do. I just don't like the vibes right now. Let's just keep moving. Try to get as much ground as we can before he shows up. It's getting pretty dark. Yeah, I don't know how we haven't found like any sort of trail. Yeah. Like. What are we doing? I don't know. I would say that it's nice that it's not so wild on the ground anymore, but yeah. there's still no like visible trail. Yeah, still no visible trail. Well, what do you want to do? Well, it is pretty dark, so I think if we go any further into the woods, we're probably just gonna get lost. And visibility right now is super low, guys. So I think we're gonna pull up the tent. We're gonna set it up right here. Okay, spooky. Is that a person? It sounded like it. All the way out here? I know, we're in the middle of nowhere. Hello? I don't think we want them to know we're here. What if it was that person that we saw earlier? You know? Well, there's no way they're running hopefully out there. Hopefully, there's leaving. not more than one running around here, is all I'd have to say about that. How, how would they be out here without like a flashlight? Maybe they're used to it. Who knows just, though? I agree with what you were saying. Set up camp right here. Yeah. Somewhere. This doesn't seem very open. Let's try to head back a bit. Okay. Yeah, because if we go any further, like we don't want to get lost. You know? Okay. Let's look around this area. If there's any like open spot for the tent, mm -hmm. we'll start setting up camp. Okay. But. Right now, let's just look around. Okay. I think this spot is nice. pretty open. So. Oh, fuck. What? The light. It just what? died. How? No. Yeah. There's no light. I can't see a thing now. Just the sky. Okay. Well, I should have a charger in my bag. Let's just get the tent set up before it actually gets like pitch black out here. Okay. And once we could do that, we could get all our stuff charged. I just want to focus on getting camp set up. Yeah, so. especially if something, if someone's walking around. Yeah, the tent, there. right? Yeah. Bag. Okay, yeah. Let me grab it. Okay, guys. So you probably can't see anything. This is our one and only light source for right now. So we're going to try to keep this on while I set this up and actually I might just set it up in the dark and then cut to when we're doing this because this might get really really hot um, and I do want to save this for our fire so I'm going to set up the tent guys the f 
was that? Michelle? That was closer. Okay, guys, I'm gonna cut the camera. Me and Shaw are gonna sit in the tent right here and we're gonna try to be as stealthy as possible. We don't want any of these freaks spotting out our campsite. Okay, this is the last one. Got it? Let's get the hell in there. Okay. Come over here. Here it is. Let's open that. All right. Shh, shh. What is that? What the fuck? Is that something? Whoa. Sprinting? Whoa. Whoa. Get in the tent. Get in the tent now. What the hell? <laughs> Guys, this tent setup was absolutely brutal. Ow, it's freaking hot. Yeah, gotcha. Whew, yeah, I'm sweating. It is freaking humid out here. And the mosquitoes are going crazy. The mosquito going crazy. Setting up this tent was absolutely insane, but I think it's time we could set up the bed in here try to keep it as stealthy as possible because we have been hearing like weird noises as you can tell yeah. there's literally something like sprinting towards us earlier it's not something we want to attract for sure let's try to get the bed here and the sleeping bag out and then we could probably just like pass out for the night and start hiking tomorrow morning okay all right guys if you notice around us we are welcome to tent. my crib right this is mtv cribs mm -hmm. we got the sleeping bag we got the little mattress on the ground we're camping out here. We are camping in, I guess what we're gonna call right now is the undead forest. And so we're basically packing it up for the night. We got the camera light charged as well as this thing charged. So we do have some light for the rest of the night. Holy crap, I am sweating. It is freaking hot out here, guys. It's not a joke. Whew. We do this for you guys, so make sure to go down below, subscribe to the channel if you enjoy this type of content because we put ourselves in these crazy situations all the time, as well as...
must be like one of those like patients from the underground tunnel. Yeah. Like somehow like got loose and now he's like in the woods. That's someone you definitely don't want to confront. Yeah. No, these guys have been underground for years, guys. They have no idea how to interact with like people these days, so. And they're paying just like shut the tent. Like does it not see the light though? If they're roaming around out here. Well, we don't have a fire, so like there's no way they actually know that this is it. Plus, it seemed like he was like touching the tent for no particular reason. So I don't think it even knows what this thing is. <laughs> Might have not seen one before. Were there tents in like the 19th century? I don't know. Not these kinds, anyway. I thought I heard something. Um, well, I think we're okay. Are you sure? I think we're fine, yeah. We're not walking in the pitch black, that's for sure. What do you mean that's true? I don't know. Like, I'm not, am, I, am I even going to be able to sleep tonight? I don't think we are. Knowing that just like random people are walking around. Yeah, I think we're fine. So, guys, we're going to probably cut the camera for the night. We don't want to waste all of our batteries because we are on a very long hike towards the village and we're just going to try to pass out. Hopefully nothing else approaches us in the morning. Crossed. Yeah, fingers crossed nobody chases us. In the morning, we'll pack all our stuff, pack the tent, and we'll start heading towards the undead village and see if we could find the tunnel where these things are coming from. So, I'll see you guys in the morning. Okay, the camera's on. Camera's on? Yeah. Is that everything? I think so. Did you like miss anything? Because I would check. really suck if we needed a tent and we didn't have the parts for it. Yeah. I think you're good. Okay. <gasps> this in your bag. Yeah. <sighs> Tents in the bag. We're ready to continue the hike. We didn't get any sleep last night. There was like, for some reason, once the sun was like out, whatever that thing was that approached our tent, there imagine just like multiple, dozens and dozens more of them, just like everywhere in the woods, howling at each other, screaming at each other. I felt like I was in some kind of zoo. Yeah, I don't know what the hell so, was going on, but I was way too sleep. afraid. I was way too afraid to even get out and look. Yeah. Especially after the first thing came out to our tent. Yeah, like the very no. first thing set up our tent that happens and then there's all that. I recorded a clip on my phone. I could probably put it up right here. And you guys could tell that if you were here, you probably wouldn't sleep either. But I think, yeah, I'm super tired. Yeah, like, I know. My brain way. isn't even functioning properly. We got no coffee, no iced chai tea lattes out here, nothing. So we could either walk back home or go back in there and try to find that village. Okay, well, hello. I'm just kidding. We're going to find okay. the village. <laughs> I'm like, we literally already we came, came all, all this way. way. We're going to keep going through here. We're going to find one of those other trails. Hopefully, it'll take us to the village. And we'll finally be able to get some kind of footage of what this place actually looks like. Can and we, sorry, can we take a second to think, where were these, these people during our hike? Well, it was like, once the sun came up, all the noise has kind of stopped. I don't know if it's something to do with the daytime, but like in the day, everything seems calm. Like, I don't hear anybody versus at night. It was like constant screaming and shouting. It was insane. So maybe they're sleeping. Let's just like try to maybe stay quiet. Make sure we don't run into any of these like creeps like lying in like one of the bushes or whatnot. Right? That but, would be like the scariest thing ever. Yeah. We're going into here. We're going to find that village for you guys. Try to get as much footage as we can and maybe find the tunnels 
and see maybe these things are coming from inside there. I'm not sure, but we're gonna find out. Yeah, we still gotta find those investigators too. So, you ready? ready? I'm trying to think of which trail to pick. I don't know why there's so many variations to go. Well, we just came from behind, so aren't we just supposed to keep going straight? Thought we were on the yeah. the right path. The thing is, the sun is now in front of us which isn't making too much sense to me. What, did we just go in one big fat circle? I don't know, I'm trying to find a landmark of some sort. I don't, I don't really want to pull out the compass, but I might have to. So guys, if you ever want to go on a hike with Hype Mike, just know that there are some chances you may get lost. I've gotten lost many times. Multiple times. <laughs> I have a poor track record for getting lost. In yeah, place. so. But I go on trails that aren't official, that's why. It's okay. Just give your excuses if you really need to, but... I gotta pull out this stupid compass now. Yep, pull it out. Okay. Hopefully we didn't like part two. What is, Who is that? that? Get out of here! Michelle, what? Go. 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 What the hell? He's right there. He's literally yelling. Get out! Come inside. Over here. <laughs> Jesus. Who is that? I don't know. Come on. Back here, back here, back here. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Help! Go, 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 go! Running into all these like weirdos. Where's the compass? Okay. So somewhere that way. That way? Okay. Yeah. Lead the way. What the frick, man? And I guess just be ready to sprint. You see. Yeah. See him again. You brought your running shoes, that's mm -hmm. good. Whew. Hold up. What? I think I see something. What? Another man? No, no, no. Like a structure of some sort. Oh. I think this might be like the beginning of it. Oh, no is way. Is that some good news? Hopefully that's good news. It's good news for the adventure purpose. How long has it been? Freaking two days. Finally, we made it to the undead village. Whew, this is scary. Yeah, that's a building, all right. That looks crazy. Wow. Look, there's cool already place. like a... Super. Like a broken swing set. Mm -hmm. I see it. What, what is the that? What is that? Is that someone coming? Someone running even worse? No. Don't scare me. Well, I don't see anything. I hear it though. What is that sound? Ow! Careful, what? Watch the thorns on that one. <laughs> She's We're a out biter. In the wilds out here. This is insane. Is this another? I was thinking, board? hopefully, none of us gets a tick on us or something. I think we'll be okay. The grass is definitely very long. Ow! You okay? Yep, I got stabbed. Ow! Told you. Look how long 
called? Sometimes like falling from the tree. Maybe it's a squirrel just throwing down nuts. I could see like little things falling. That's how it's planting more trees. <laughs> okay, well, this is the first building. You could even see over there. If you look, there's another building across that over one there, looks even creepier. covered in trees. Yeah, that looks super creepy. Okay, let's check it out. Mm -hmm. have definitely been here. Oh, for sure. There's graffiti all over the place. Knock, see if anyone's home. I don't know if there's any alarms in this place. <laughs> Imagine someone came out. Ladies first. There's like a little opening here. <laughs> Through the window you go. I'm starting to yeah. think you're just using that as an excuse because you're scared. Am it's, I? I guess so. Okay, what's like the... It stinks in there. First yeah, that's kind of bad. Wait, which what is that? Yo. Let's go. Go, go, go. Yo. <laughs> where the main building is? No idea. Can't even get in here. Can you Unless see? You break. Is it too dark? No, I can see it. That's good. Okay. <laughs> the mold is bussing in here. I'm pretty sure that's what the smell is. Yeah, this place is pretty uh, spooky. It's spooky enough, let alone having someone chase you in the area. Yeah, I don't even feel comfortable going outside right now. Is that him? Yeah. Should we go back the other way? Let's 
check out other parts of the building. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Glass is holding on by a thread. Open and busted. Yeah, we literally would be stuck in here. That's so fudged up. Yeah. So. What? I don't what is know he doing? That guy on side is like planning like a way to like get in. Right. If he's just like stalking us now. Yeah, he ran up through the bushes to get us, and then the moment we're like at the building, he's sprinting. I think it's a good idea to keep the light off on the camera for now until like we really, really need it because yeah, then it's just gonna saving a battery and then also just like it'll be less attention or you know be less obvious for whoever's watching us if anyone is watching us. Mm -hmm. Let's yeah, try to be, stay incognito. Yeah, I don't you know. Oh, you can't hold hands. Hello! Michelle just entered the chat. Well, I'm waiting for nighttime. I'm waiting. Right, you're wearing all black and I'm wearing camo. I'm Who's nice better guy. dressed, guys, for the occasion? Let us know. So these are like cubicles almost. Like where people used to work. Maybe? I don't know. That could be a possibility. Mm, there are beds here, so maybe this is like a. Sick bay. Man, everything's like destroyed. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is a good spot. We could just clean this mattress. We got two mattresses. Oh, so you have, you can put them together and have a big bed to sleep in there you go. by yourself. So for twenty four hours. I get one point nine nine million subs. I will sleep in that bed. So I think we're at the end of the building. Yeah. Okay. I can't see anything. Yeah, I would turn on flashlight. Scary. Now it's starting to get dark. Ew. What? I just stepped in that. That's disgusting. Ew. Yeah, that yeah, looks literally your... like pee. That's gross. It's like another medical room or something. Are you from surgery? Maybe. I don't know, this Brain whole place surgery. is weird. I guess this is our exit right here. This little window. Gentlemen first. Sure. <laughs> Show them how it's done. So this is how you, I wouldn't say necessarily sneak through a window, but just, you know, maneuver on, maneuver on through. Not the struggle. Thank God no one's chasing you. <laughs> right? So otherwise well, that would have been... Chased, uh... I would have tried a little harder. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's a deer. Where? Another one. Right there. Oh, shit. That's a skinwalker. I fucking hope not. Should I whistle? Don't whistle. Don't whistle. Yeah, just like stand. 
so I should definitely whistle. Or we should just sing. Yeah, look at how overgrown. Yeah, this is pretty crazy, guys. Like, this is our exit. If it's a deer, it'll run away, right? If it's a skinwalker, you know, it'll do something. Wow, are we having a staring competition? Like, hello? You okay? Hi. Oh, that's yeah. pretty cool. Look, there's like a basketball court over here. Old basketball court. Well, it is old. <laughs> it is old. What makes well, you look at that? it. There's not even a a hoop to go through. <laughs> that's how they used to play basketball back in the day. Nice. No hoop. Every shot's a point. Yeah, every time you hit the board. The backboard, yep. Well, we're approaching another building. What? Right? Corner-ish. It's the back rooms, just yeah, these abandoned buildings. buildings. Yeah, that'd be pretty uh, awful. Yeah, careful with all the glass and stuff. Shh. It's an animal? Watch out. Nice. There's warnings everywhere. You hear that too, right? Let's go. Exit, exit. It's like a big building. That looks huge. Big building, yeah. Okay, we're just gonna take a look at a run for it. Mm-hmm. Seems like the coast is clear. 
Go. 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 This way, this way, this way. What the hell was that? Let's get to this. Holy crap. Is he there? Did they follow us? I don't think he left the building. Let's keep moving. That was for sure somebody. What the f This is the mother load right here. I don't know if it was this building, but the main building, which I'm assuming is this, struck by lightning, everyone inside basically died, all patients of the insane like village. And now it looks like this, trees, grass, tires. I don't know how that got there. Whew. I need to start doing some sprints. Practice for my videos. Let's get in there. Yeah. It's gonna be out in the open like this. There's an entrance right here. Oh man, this is insane. If it's anything like the building we were just in, Whatever's in there might just be worse. Holy shit, is that him? What? Where? I'm sorry, over there. Look, but he's going the other way. No way. Yeah, I think I just saw him go over there. Oh shit. Come on, I see okay. you. The door's right there, so come on. deer ever walk in here? I doubt it. Look. What the hell? Look, this is all melted. Mm -hmm. You see it burnt everywhere. Yep. Oh, even this. Papers one. everywhere. Just charcoal right there. Burnt paper. I mean, look at the ceiling. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. Just pieces of metal hanging from wires. Yeah, not the safest environment. That's for sure. Am I Indiana Jones right now? Careful. A version of him. See, Lucasfilms has hired me to make the Indiana Jones movies. Indiana Jones movies? <laughs> Is it June? Jones, not June. <laughs> it's the Jones bugs. Mm -hmm. This is just crazy right here. Like, all this has been burnt. All because of the curse that was laid on this village a long time ago. Just dead hallways and dead rooms. This is sick. I mean, it is for me. I don't know if you guys have ever played the game The Last of Us, but that's what this is giving. If you ever played the main menu, the move in. <laughs> Cue the music. Yeah. All my Last of Us fans, go down below. I want to know how many people played that game. Let's see uh, Michelle's dream view. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Good morning. Wow. Undead village. Bugs. Good morning, Mr. Bug. Spider. Got Come on, it. let me show you around. <laughs> Welcome to my crib. Let me take you into the gates of hell. This is where it all happened, guys. Everything burnt. People screaming, begging for help, and nobody coming to get them. What happened here is an absolute tragedy. Oh my god, this is so cool. It's 
was the bathroom. <laughs> what is the bathroom? this? What is that? Yeah. Is this a tub? I think so. I guess where you could like sit. No, what is this? These are weird. A, re a reader. Hmm. Well, it's in the washroom for a reason. You need to dry your hands? Um, <laughs> I'll dry them when I get home. Don't die. Nice. So what are these documents? Senior timeline. Like, so random. Papers everywhere. Freshman year, sophomore year, continuing year. Like, what? High school students? What? Mothman exists. No way. That's creepy. I'm sure we're in the right place. If Mothman is here, right, we like are in the wrong place. There's too many, too many entities at once. Comment down below if you want to see me chase after Mothman, because mm -hmm. I've heard some rumors and I've seen some clips. Mothman is like absolutely terrifying, which is why I haven't done it yet. But if you guys want it, you gotta talk. What the f- What? I what? don't know what the- f Something just like glowed at me. What? Eyes? I swear to God. Like I swear. Eyes or I don't know. Over there though. Through the window. Well, we have a lot to explore. Check the clip. Check the clip. Oh nice. my God. Ugh! Oh, good. I didn't have to go anyways. I didn't want to go in there, too. Whoa, did you hear that? I'm done. Keep, just, just go. Get me out of here. This is creepy. Like a long, dark hallway. Damn, how far does it go? Do we go down there? I dare you go in there. Okay. But I have to stay here. You gotta give me light. At yeah, least. I'm just kidding. I don't want to be by myself. Are you crazy? <laughs> <laughs> this is where you saw that glow, I think. In here? Yeah. Through here, I think. I don't really want to touch anything. I don't know if it was this room. I can't tell. Oh, I guess that is. It was here. I don't know. Nothing sparkly in here. But I saw something glowing. It's really fudged up. Where'd you go? Michelle? Don't even try to be funny right now. Hello? Hey! You're so stupid. Why? I was here the whole time. No, you're trying to be, you're trying to be funny. <laughs> and it's okay. No, 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 it's okay. We Is don't it? play games in the scary asylum. Sure, no worries. I didn't go that no, far. No, 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 no. Okay. I could have came all the no, way over here okay. and it's really okay. pulled your leg. It's okay, because if you want to play that game, you're going to lose. Am I? I think I already won. So, uh, God, no. How about a ride on the elevator? Fudge no, baby. I'm That's not going messed in up. That there. You insane. How old is this? There's a piece of wood lodged in the door. I, like, a billion percent of wooden. Where's the bottom? You don't know. Exactly. Well, remember the underground tunnels? What if that's our only way down? How deep is that? You just though? hear the elevator like, start like closing falling. Mm -hmm. And I wouldn't know where to go to get you. So you'd be on your own. What is this? Look at this. Six, oh, six, 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 six. Weird. Like that's a lot of like. Sixes? I don't know. Devil worshiping, I guess. I kind of like this building. It's a lot quieter than the friggin' weird one we were just in. Another hallway. There's a staircase here. Staircase? Mm-hmm. 
we could check out upstairs and then if we want, we could go down and search for you know what. Like go down there? <laughs> yeah, I'll take upstairs. Yeah, me too. I don't think I'm ready for the, the creepiness. Oh, watch your step. It better not break, or I'm suing. <laughs> oh, I see birds in the place. This is where the birds hang out. Oh shit, look at this. What a romantic view. Mm-hmm. That's where I had my first kiss. <laughs> <laughs> This is those. where I take them. Wow, such a romantic. Do you want to come to a creepy uh, insane asylum and, uh, you know, hang out? Hey, if that's not your thing, then <laughs> Don't hate. I'm sorry. Comment down below if it's your kind of thing. <laughs> okay. How's the view? What do you think? You want to stay in there? My hands are full. Give me this. Mm -mm. Gotta go parkour. Okay, shut up. I'm not that heavy. <laughs> <laughs> we learn new things every day. <laughs> wow. Guys, this is like some cool views in my opinion. Oh, there's even a window up there. So there's like a third floor. Oh, we damn. can maybe get to. That's more down there. Mm -hmm. Damn, you crazy. Well, it would definitely be a good spot to see if any crazies are following us. Right, do you see anybody? No. But I see some deer. Where? Over there. But they're behind trees, so it's hard to see. Oh yeah, I see them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm good to just take a nap here. I'll, I'll stay here, I'll wait. Yeah? Yeah, just come get me later. I'll go in the tunnels and I'll come get you after. Yeah, just text me. You have my number, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah. All right. Okay, I'll see you later. Bye. <laughs> Bye. I was fast going up, hella slow coming <laughs> down. I just feel like very on edge every time because I don't know where that guy would have gone, you know? Well, I mean, this place is huge. And it went the opposite way. Yeah, I think we should be fine. Unless he can like smell us and it's that serious. We have a literal hound on our asses. Holy shit, this is uh, where they would put people. No. Look how small this is. That's crazy. Imagine living in like confinement like this. No, I can't. Get one little window, and this is your tub. Well, I mean, think of solitary oh, confinement. Fudge. This is cool. Little balcony. Could be cute if it wasn't so overgrown. It's still cute. <laughs> She's got potential. Ooh, there's a ladder here. Is that to your third floor? Yeah. She's sturdy. I'm crazy. Always three points of contact, guys. Hmm. See anything? Not really. Yeah, it's mostly just like an attic. Hmm? 
Chad, I don't know if you're going to like this. What? But I think it's time to go downstairs. That time? Yeah. All right, well, like you said, you have my number. And, uh... I'll meet you outside. I'll meet you. I'll meet you somewhere. Oh. That's scary. Let's just make sure this doesn't shut completely. Great. Just got no exit. Locks us in here. Okay, scary. Okay, it locks us in here and we have no choice but to go down. <laughs> this looks like insanely creepy from here too. Yeah. Just need one of those flares. It's not that bad, it's actually Drop just it. like two more floors. What's the worst that could happen, right? It's the worst that could happen? Did you actually just say that? We run into the homeless guy. I don't know. That's probably the worst, in my opinion. Or like a, an apparition. Something worse? Watch your step. That one was a little suspect. Just walk on like the edge. This is interesting. Got a lot of weird what machinery is here. What is that? I don't know. Comment down below if you guys know what machine this is. I couldn't tell you. Is this like a... Like Maybe like for surgeries or something. D dentist? <laughs> Brain <laughs> surgery? My next guess. <laughs> a dentist chair? Definitely like... I don't know. What is this? Like the red stuff. The red and then part. there's like a little like wheelie thing. Mm -hmm. It is getting pretty dark outside, so. Mm -hmm. Shh. No. There's no one down there. That hallway is dark as fuck. That noise came from down there. Hold the light. Hold the light. You can barely see. Stay here. I can go check it out. I just said I don't want us to be alone. Okay, fine. <gasps> we'll keep the camera open. Okay, good idea. What the hell? You hear that, right? Yeah. For the record, I don't think this is a good idea anymore. <gasps> oh my god. I thought I saw something. Wait. Did you see that? Yeah. What is that? It looks. That's a fire. I guess like a fire, yeah, it's flickering. No. That's why, no. That's why it smells burnt down here. Just no to whatever you're thinking. No. Come on, Charlotte. We just need to check out. Hard? No, Michelle? No. Like. Okay, you stay here. I'm just gonna see if it's the entrance, okay? Oh. What? Hurry up. I don't feel comfortable. We should leave. Let me just see. I don't think that's a good idea. When have you ever seen a fire in an abandoned place like this? Exactly. Why do you see that? What? It's like the entrance to hell? I'm good. Yeah. 
Shara? Shara, we need to run! What? Ah! Go, 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 go! Go, 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 go! Upstairs, upstairs, upstairs. Wait. This way. Go! What happened? Up, up the stairs, up the stairs. What the f We need to get out of here. Watch your step. Oh. oh my god, are you okay? Are you okay? Yeah. Go. Go. Doing a freaking insane sign on my gown or something. What? See, I told you it wasn't a good yeah, idea. Like a fire or something <sighs> down there. Are you okay? Yes, it's cold. It's okay. gonna last. It's gonna be. Yeah. I'm done with space. It's the exit. You wouldn't believe what I just saw. I'm gonna get back in the woods. the wires. That's the Okay? Yeah. I can make it. Shh, shh, shh. Oh my god. What? We need to go. He's coming. He's coming. 